What's going on everyone? Welcome to this vlog. I feel like it's been a minute since I've vlogged. But I just got done babysitting and now I am gonna go pick up mother. Go pick her up. We're just, we're just going to meet her and then we're gonna go walk. So Jamba Juice just opened. Well, it's been probably about a month. Um, but it opened now where I live and I, nor my mom, I don't think, have ever been to Jamba Juice, so we're gonna go try it. Because everybody says it's so good, and everybody was so happy we got one here where I live, so yeah, we're gonna go try it. So yeah, well, let's see how this is. If I could, look at this. You know what's very helpful? Your car dinging when you forget your key in the ignition thing, or else I would always forget the key. stereotyping people but like I feel like I'm an official vlogger now I got my camera my juice you know or it's not coffee but you know my my cup and my iPhone official vlogger now after two years Gum? oh sure do you want a half sure or do you like a full either way because I only do a half so can we sure okay verdict on Jamba Juice, that was our first time. <laughs> it was good. I got the healthy version. Yeah, what'd you get? <laughs> Calribian. I don't remember mine. I think it was like Aloha Pineapple. It was interesting. Hold please, there's a car. Mine had kale in it. What's that? I can't remember what else was in there. Just trying to be healthy. Yeah. I just tried a classic. It was good. It was good. Mm -hmm. First time. And then we'll go back next month. <laughs> Try another flavor. Yeah. Yeah, right? Okay. So, you know, I suck at vlogging. Next day, um, I am going to go get my hair cut. I really just need it like trimmed up and cleaned up because when I get long hair or like my hair grows, I get a big head. Like I don't know why my head just gets big. So I'm gonna go get a haircut, get it cleaned up, and then in a little bit, Angie and I are gonna head up to Pine Valley and go take some pictures because it has been a while since I have done a photo shoot and she was like, yo, let's do a photo shoot. So yeah, we're gonna go take pictures in a little bit go up to Pine Valley so that's gonna be super fun I'm super excited to go so but I want to get my hair cut all cleaned up and whatever before we go take pictures so here we go let's start today okay here's before it's kind of just a mess I feel like and here's after can you tell the difference I didn't go super short like we kept it a little longer just because I don't know I've I don't like to go super, super short. I like to keep a little length, but yeah. Can you tell a difference? I need to kind of clean it up now, though. But, ta-da! Check off the list. Okay, let's go home. I need some food. I actually haven't eaten today still, and it is... What time is it? Come on. It is almost 1 in the afternoon. So I need to go eat and get all the cameras ready to go take pictures. I am excited. Here we go. Again. Okay, just got home, and when I was pulling in, I saw the mail lady putting the mail in, so... <sighs> I'm gonna go try this again. I'm getting frustrated with the mail. So there was absolutely nothing in our mailbox, so either she like forgot we had mail or wow, we actually had a day with no mail. 
So about a month ago, yeah, about a month, all of a sudden, like, this listing came up, like, these listings, um, for the Peter Pan Disney Infinity figure that was never released. Like, like thousands of them just on this website. Um, anyways, they were, like, selling, a, like, thousands of Disney Infinity Peter Pan figures that, like, were pretty much complete and whatever, you know, they weren't in the packaging though, but you know, the, the actual figure and whatever. And they were like selling them for like five dollars a piece. And you know, so like a bunch of people got on it, you know, like let's see if it's legit and whatever. And so I ordered one, and well, here's the story time. So I ordered one, okay, on January 4th. And, you know, it's coming from China, which, so, you know, you have to expect, it's going to take a little bit to get here. I understand. Okay? So, like, two weeks later, after I'd ordered one, people started receiving theirs. I was like, whoa. You know, so I'm looking at mine, and um, as of the 10th, it was still just chilling in China. Nothing. So I was like, okay, so then a little more time had gone on. Mine was still chilling in China and more people had gotten there. So I was like, well, shoot. So uh, someone on Twitter that I uh, bought one and got one, whatever, was like, here, you know, I had to reorder as well, get, um, buy one, you know, here and whatever. He gave me a link. So I bought a second one and, you know, okay, now I gotta wait. So more people start getting theirs, more people, more people. Okay, so it is, you know, January 31st today. Like, so many people have gotten theirs, and like, there was someone that said, yeah, I got all 12 of mine. First of all, holy crap, you ordered, you ordered 12? Second of all, how did you get all 12 already? Like, I haven't even gotten one, okay? So, my original order finally updated on January 23rd, and said it had made it to LA, uh, California, and that the expected delivery date was January 29th. So January 29th came around and still there was no update on it. Like, hadn't moved from LA. Okay, and then my my second order was like, all of a sudden, bam, bam, bam. It was updating. And it had, it like said it was in local delivery office. Um, but that that's where it's been ever since, uh, like, last Friday. And so, yeah, it's just chilling in local delivery office. Does that mean it's in my, like, post office? Bronx, I'm on this door. Please hold. So I'm just like, why? So then this morning, my original order finally updated and said, oh, there was a delay. Um, it's still in LA. We've just moved it to our regional facility. And we will update you when there's a... Um, updated delivery. Now, I get it. You know, there there's delays and things and whatever. I get it. But, like, seriously, LA, I could drive drive there. It's It takes six hours. I could drive there and back in a day and go pick it up myself. Like, I don't know. I'm just getting frustrated that, like, so many people have gotten theirs and, you know, like, a bunch of people have ordered multiple and they've gotten all theirs and I have even gotten one. And so I'm just like, uh, 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 I know it's a first world problem thing to be upset about and whatever. But as soon as it arrives, you better know we're doing an unboxing video. Anyways, that's my story time. Hey, friend. Hey. Okay. How are you? I'm doing good. How are you? Good. So I realized. I have three coats. Walking what? <laughs> a walking contradiction. <laughs> Like in like a super super bright shirt and then like BAM leather jacket. <laughs> I don't know. Alright guys, so we 
made it to Pine Valley. The sun is setting. We're just trying to get some pictures, okay? Work with us, people. Golden hour. They blocked it off, so we can't go in more. So we gotta do with what we got. And that's that's what we got right now. The golden hour. guys it's freezing and I'm just getting cold you can do it. <laughs> the things you do for pictures gotta sport the red You for the moment. Okay. <laughs> what picture should I use, guys? This time. Okay, sunsets are just always worth it. Even if it's cold. Look at it. Cold does not do this weather justice. Exactly. Are you holding up? Um, yeah. <laughs> we'll go with that. <laughs> I took off my coat for the shots. Good job. Thanks. Well, I'm wearing festive colors. True. So. I can't, I can't hold the camera still. 